guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we've got episode number 19, the Los Angeles Angels franchise mode here on MLB 21, this show. Let's get straight into it. We have the trade deadline. I'm not going to make too many moves, but I'm going to take this one. I mean, Pedro Strope for Willie Calhoun. I don't like trading within the division, but I, I don't really see how that's going to benefit the Rangers that much. Willie Calhoun was killing us when we played them in our last game against the Rangers. I think I'm going to keep Calhoun on the bench. We'll see what happens with that, just because I like Brandon Marsh instead of him. But he's a really good pinch hitter off the bench. And also, we're going to trade for a bullpen arm, and it's going to be Jordan Hicks. Um, I'm going to move Tommy Hunter over to St. Louis. He's been solid for us this season, but let's be real. Jordan Hicks is a lot better and a lot younger. He's 25 years old. He's got a sinker, a slider, and a fastball. And the sinker and fastball reach upper 90s. He's a beast. I'm going to take it. Two other prospects will go to St. Louis. That's all right. And we're going to keep Jordan Hicks as a middle reliever. He's going to get a lot of playing time. Don't worry. But I do like like Diekman and Miller as our setup guys. Both of those guys have like a 1.3 ERA. They've been tremendous this season. So if you do remember last episode, we're only a couple games back now of the division of the Oakland Athletics. And look at that. Adalberto Mondesi going from the Royals to the Indians. A weird division trade going on right there, but he will be heading on over to Cleveland. And yeah, the Angels are currently sitting at a record of 53 wins and 47 losses. Now 48 losses with that loss to the Athletics. And we're going to play the Los Angeles Dodgers in today's episode. Not this series with them. We're going to play the series back in Anaheim. Hopefully we can pick up a couple wins going into that series, but yeah, we're on a kind of a losing streak. We won a game. All right, we won two in Houston. Drop another. We're 55-52 now, and we lose that last game against the Dodgers. We're six games back now of the Athletics. Uh, that's not good. All right, so 55-53. We have some room to make up. I think we're four games out the wild card right now, so we'll see what happens tonight. Of course, we are playing the Los Angeles Dodgers, and this Dodgers team is pretty damn stacked. They are currently 63-47. and 47. Mookie Betts still on this team. Cody Bellinger, Max Muncy, Justin Turner, Michael Brantley is now here in LA as well. This Dodgers team is absolutely stacked in. Folks, if you have not yet, make sure to the subscribe button down below for more MLB 21 The Show here on the channel. And pitching tonight for the Dodgers, by the way, is going to be Clayton Kershaw. And for the Angels, it is Dylan Bundy. 7-8 record so far this season with a 3.83 ERA over 21 starts. Here we go. He will see Michael Brantley first on the 2-1 count. And Michael Brantley's going to hit that ball in the left field and it's going to get down. Brantley's going to have himself a leadoff base knock for the Dodgers. He's looking for two. The relay and Brantley is going to be around the tag. So, runner on second here. No outs for Jacob Amaya on the 1-2. He's going to hit that ball in the center field. But Mike Trout will be there to make the play. One gone now in the inning for Mookie Betts, the former MVP on the 2-2 count. Betts swearing to miss on the slider way by Bundy. Two gone now in the inning for Cody Bellinger on the 3-2. He will hit that ball right in front of the plate. There to make the play will be Kieber Ruiz playing his former team in the Dodgers here tonight. And now let's go on to the bottom of the first inning where Clayton Kershaw is pitching for the Dodgers. He's still got it. 2.36 ERA this season with an 11 and 4 record. Up first for the Angels will be Corey Seager on the 1-2 count. And Kershaw is going to get him with the slider away. The former Dodger strikes out right there. Now Anthony Rendon comes up on the 3-2. High fastball. No need to swing. Rendon is on with a one-out walk, setting up Mike Trout on the 1-1 one -one count. Trout will hit that ball on the ground, straight to Justin Turner, and the Dodgers are going to turn the double play. And just like that, the bottom of the first inning is over on the top of the second. Will Smith leads it off for LA, and he'll blast that ball into right field. And in back-to-back -back innings, the Dodgers have lead-off base hits. Max Muncy now comes up on the 3-2 count. He swings and misses on the curveball down. One down now for Justin Turner. On the full count, another strikeout for Bundy. Slider away, puts Turner down. Bundy's third strikeout of the game. Now Edwin Rios, strike three on the fastball as well. Three strikeouts in the inning for Bundy. Now in the bottom of the second, Jorge Soler is going to pop that ball up in the infield. There will be the catcher. It is Will Smith. One down for Shohei Otani. Now in the one, two. Otani's going to pull that slider right down the first baseline. But that first base will be Max Muncy. So two down now in the inning for David Fletcher. On the three, one count. He sees a high fastball. Fletcher's going to pull that ball deep in the inner left field. But it's going to end up straight in the glove of Michael Brantley. We are now in the top of the third inning where Hansera Alberto is at the plate. He's going to swing and miss on the curveball down. One gone in the inning for Michael Brantley. Now in the two, two. He hits that ball straight to short. And there is Corey Seager for the second out of the inning. Now bring up Jacob Amaya on the 1-2. Bundy's going to deal on Swainamus on the curveball down. Bundy has been dealing so far. Three scoreless innings for him. On the bottom of the third, the Angels still looking for their first base knock, and they're not going to get it right there. Jared Walsh hits it to his opposing first baseman. There is Max Muncy. One down now for Brandon Marsh. On the 1-1, one, one, Marsh will hit that ball hard on the ground at second base. There's a dive at second by Alberto, and Marsh is going to get on with the single. 
It is a one out infield hit for Brandon Marsh. Now, Keeper Ruiz in the one two hit that ball in the air deep into center field. Will that ball get down? It will not. In center is Cody Bellinger. Two gone now for Corey Seager on the 3 2. That's ball four. Runners on first and second. Two outs now for Tony Tubax himself. Anthony Rendon on the 2 2. Tony gonna hit that ball on the ground to short. There to make the play is Jacob Amaya. Let's now go to the top of the fourth inning. Still scoreless. And now Mookie Betts is up on the 1 2. He hits that ball right into the shift. Jared Walsh gonna get that one over to Dylan Bundy. One down now, four. Cody Bellinger on the full count. Bundy deals high fastball, and Bellinger's gonna turn on one. Deep in the air to right field, you can kiss that one goodbye. Cody Bellinger has got himself a one out home run for the Dodgers as they take a one nothing lead in this ball game. Will Smith now comes up on the 2-2 count. Smith going to swing right through that slider away. So two down now in the inning for the left-handed first baseman. It is Max Muncy. 2-2 count. Bundy deals. Swanimous on the curveball away. Let's go to the bottom of the fourth inning. Again, the Angels are now down by one though. Mike Trout is up on the 2-2. They say he swung on that curveball down. That'll be the first out in the bottom of the fourth inning. Bringing up the power bat is Jorge Soler. 1-2 count. Kershaw deals. And Soler can't catch up to the slide. Or they say foul tipped it right there. So now two down for Shohei Otani on the one two slider away lefty lefty. It's just tough. All I can say right there on it to the top of the fifth inning. Justin Turner leads it off for the Dodgers. He will hit that ball on the ground right to second base. There is David Fletcher one down out in the inning for the third baseman. It is Edwin Rios. Yeah, I said Justin Turner was playing third base earlier. Apparently he's DHing. Rios though swings and misses on the fastball away. Ninth strikeout of the ball game for Bunty. And now Hanser Alberto comes up with a one two. He hits that ball over the middle, but David Fletcher what a play. He's gonna get him. On to the bottom of the fifth inning where David Fletcher leads it off for the Dodgers. One, two, count. He pops the slider up into shallow left field. In left field is going to be Michael Brantley. One down out in the inning for Jared Walsh. On the full count, Walsh going to draw a ball for the slider in. We will take it. One out base runner now for the Angels with Brandon Marsh up on the one. One, he bounces one right down the first baseline. Hey, it moves the runner over with two outs. We will take it. Walsh is now going to be at second base for Kiebert Ruiz on the 3-2. And Ruiz is going to do it again. Hits the ball to left field. Coming to play is going to be Jared Walsh. And he's in there. The Angels have tied this one. Ruiz to second. Kiebert Ruiz delivers against his former team here tonight. And Corey Seager, unfortunately, can't right there. Will Smith will make the play, but that ends the fifth inning. But again, we are tied at one run. To the top of the sixth, Michael Brantley leads it off for the Dodgers, and he will pick up his second base knock of this ball game into right field. So leadoff runner on for the Dodgers for Jacob Amaya. On the 1-1 count, runner going! And Amaya sees a fastball center center, and he turns on it. And that ball is out off the foul pole. 357 feet for Amaya as he gives the Dodgers a 3-1 to one lead in this game. No outs in the inning still for Mookie Betts in the 2-2. He hits that ball hard in the air into right field, but there to make the play will be Jorge Soler. One gone now in the inning for Cody Bellinger on the 1-2 count. Bundy deals and Bellinger going to get another good hole in that one, but in right field is Jorge Soler back to make the play. Two down out in the inning for the catcher, Will Smith on the 1-2 count. Smith going to hit that ball hard right up the middle, but there is going to be David Fletcher with the diving play. Let's go to the bottom of the sixth inning where the Angels are now down by two runs. Anthony Rendon leads it off for LA and he hits that ball hard in the air into center field, but on a line straight to Cody Bellinger. One down for Mike Trout now on the 2-2. High break in 12-6 and Trout's going to turn on one. Deep in the air to center and Bellinger again though is back to make the play. Two down for Jorge Soler on the 1-1. He hits that ball again hard in the air into center. But there to make the play one more time is Cody Bellinger. That does it for the sixth inning. Loud out so far for the Angels. And that'll do it for Dylan Bundy. End of the game is Andrew Miller. 1.75 ERA in the season for him. Over 37 games and 36 innings. His first batter will be Max Muncy on the lefty-lefty on the 1-2. And Muncy hits that ball on the left field. Got to readjust right there is Brandon Marsh. He plays back and he's got it. One it down now in the inning for Justin Turner. On the 1-1 one, one count, Turner gets the high inside fastball and pops that ball in the infield. There, though, to make the play will be Andrew Miller. Two down now in the inning for Edwin Rios. Lefty, lefty, 2-2. Two, two. Swing and a miss on the slider away by Miller. As we now head to the bottom of the seventh inning where Shohei Otani leads it off for the Angels. Hard hit ball, but again, right to second base. And that will be the first out of the inning. David Fletcher now comes up on the full count. Kershaw deals. Swing and a miss on the curveball. 
Kershaw does it to the Angels one more time. Two down in the inning on the 3-2 for Jared Walsh. Slider over the center of the plate, and there we go. Jared Walsh has got himself a two-out base knock, bringing the tying run to the plate, which will be Brandon Marsh on the 2-2. Fastball down, and that one's going to go right to short, and that will end the seventh inning. On to the top of the eighth we go, and here we go, making his Angels debut is Jordan Hicks. 4.45 ERA on the season for him so far. Let's see if he can get the job done. He will see Hanser Alberto first in the 2-2, and he will force the pop out on that sinker down 99 miles an hour on the sinker. One gone now in the inning from Michael Brantley. On the 1-2 count, Brantley again. He'll pop that ball up into the infield. David Fletcher this time is there to make the play. He is under it, and he has got it. Two gone now for Jacob Amaya. Went yard earlier on the one two count. Swainamus on the slider down by Hicks. Let's head to the bottom of the eighth inning. Heber Ruiz is up on the one two. By the way, Blake Trinan now pitching for the Dodgers. Kershaw's day is done, but Ruiz will pop that ball up into right field. One gone in the inning for Corey Seager on the three two count. Sinker down, rips that ball into the left center field gap. The Dodgers will cut it off, so Seager is forced to stay at one, but a solid one out base knock right there. Anthony Rendon now comes up with the one two. He pulls that ball to left field back to back base knocks for the angels runners on first and second one out and here comes mike trout full count for trout oh my goodness he hits it right back to the mound trying into amaya amaya to muncie and that ends the inning we're going straight to the bottom of the ninth inning. Jake Diekman pitched a 1-2-3 inning in the top of the ninth for los angeles but now jorge soler comes up with a 2-2 count that's a strike all right, the umpire wants to get out of here. I don't know what that was. That was ball three. Now, Shoei Otani comes up on the 2-1. That ball sit over the middle. There to make the play, though, is going to be Jacob Amaya. Two gun in the inning. The last hope for the Angels is David Fletcher, the second baseman. On the 2-1, he will hit that fastball high in the air into center field. There to make the play is the former MVP. It is Cody Bellinger, and that will do it for this ball game. The Los Angeles Dodgers go to Anaheim and pick up a 3-1 victory over the Angels off a great pitching performance from Clayton Kershaw and key home runs from Cody Ballinger and Jacob Amaya. And for the Angels, just not enough production from the bats here tonight. Only five hits in this ballgame. Well, hell, the Dodgers only had five hits as well. But still, that Mike Trout double play really killed it in the top of the eighth inning. For the man who is right now in the lead for the AL MVP voting is Mike Trout. He just overtook Randy Rosarena the other day. And folks, that'll do it for episode number 19 of the Los Angeles Angels franchise mode here at MLB 21. The show, if you have not yet, make sure to subscribe button down below for more. And Mamba, forever.